Bob Nakamoto is the chair of a very exciting symposium on Monday. Now, Bob, it is the future of biophysics. You are highlighting the work of some young researchers. Give us an overview. Yeah, this uh, particular symposium is, is designed to select the younger people who are uh, on an interface between physics and, and biology. Um, and other, the other, otherwise, there's no restrictions to, to the people who are selected. So we uh, selected program committee, and I selected four four people in quite different areas. And so we're trying to sort of, you know, not overweigh one area, but try to distribute the the, the topics that are coming out. So there's uh, William Greenleaf from uh, genetics at Stanford University, who's a uh, uh, person who, who analyzes the genomes and and, and uh, on a single molecule, single cell level. Uh, Mary Kraft from the University of uh, Illinois in Urbana-Champaign, uh, who's a membrane person who's using very exciting uh, new technique of, of uh, uh, high resolution imaging in secondary IMS spectroscopy. So I'm very interested to learn about that. It's very exciting stuff. Uh, Elijah Roberts from uh, Department of Biophysics at Johns Hopkins University, who's a uh, systems at, uh, person who's uh, looking at the behavior of cells in complex systems, which is a theme that I, I really am very excited about, is getting the biophysics back into the cell level and the tissue level. Uh, and Megan Valentine from uh, University of California, Santa Barbara, who's uh, uh, doing these nanoscale manipulations to look at cytoskeletal interactions. So I think fairly exciting topics. Yeah, Bob, those are very rich and diverse topics. How did you choose those four? Well, again, we... Um, we wanted different areas, but we started simply by looking at candidates. You know, everything is about the people. So we, uh, I asked the committee for, for nominations. This is uh, sponsored by the Burroughs Walcom Foundation, so they have their list of, of uh, awardees that we're able to look at. Uh, so, and just, you know, it, it is a candy shop. <laughs> All these wonderful things. So then after making up a list of people out you know, we're just really obviously doing very exciting things. And we then we said, okay, we have to diverse uh, and pick different areas to represent the society broadly. So again, I, I hope people will come to this, probably hear talks done in their own area, but it's a way to, to, to pick up ideas, cross-fertilize uh, uh, different areas of the society. So what do you hope people walk away with at the end of this symposium? Um, the, if anything, the, the, the energy of our newer investigators um, is, is, is just uh, addictive, <laughs> I think. So um, I, I think you'll see a, a tremendous amount of that on, on, on the podium uh, as, as they go through the talks. Um, and and if, if, again, anything that leads to is, is new ideas, uh, capturing some approach that somebody's using in a different area that might apply to their own. One never knows until one hears it. So we're excited about that aspect. Bob Nakamoto, thank you very much for your time. We appreciate it. Thank you for joining us. Sure.